Welcome to our tech talk about the ARRI accessories for the Venice cameras. Next to me, unfortunately, is not a Venice 2. We were not able to get a Venice 2 here, but this is a Venice 1. And as you can see here, our accessory set, our new accessory set, is compatible with Venice 1 and Venice 2. As soon as we heard that Sony is announcing a new Venice camera, we immediately checked if our existing accessories are compatible with the new camera. And the good news is, the plate at the top is compatible with the new camera. But unfortunately, the plate at the bottom is not compatible. It's only fitting to the Venice 1. And this is due to the hump at the back of this plate. The Venice 2 now has a completely flat design underneath. There's no possibility to, to remove anything from the bottom. With the Venice 1, it was possible to remove the shoulder pad from the bottom. And this is why we designed it with a hump in the back to attach directly to the camera body. So this is why we have and we are happy to announce a new plate for Sony Venice. And as you can see here in the name, it is compatible with both versions, Venice 1 and Venice 2. It has a completely flat design on top. It has additional features such as M4 interfaces on both sides and the ARRI multi-hex screw, which can be used with different tools. So if you already own accessories, existing accessories for the Venice One, the only part you have to purchase and replace in your set is this plate. Because like this, you are able to use this, the existing accessory set with the Venice Two. At the bottom, you have two options. You can either attach to the broadcast shoulder adapter VSA1 for VCT14 quick lock um, attachment, and if you would like to have a nice shoulder pad for handheld camera, or you can attach to a bridge plate adapter BP85, which is compatible to bridge plate BP8 or BP9. When we realized we have to design anyway a new plate at the bottom, we checked the feedback we received within the last years from users for the Venice accessories. And we then decided, OK, let's just make a completely new set of accessories for the Venice 2, which will be compatible for Venice 1 as well. So that's why we also have a new top plate. And the new top plate, again, has M4 interfaces um, on each side. Again, there is the RE multi-hex screw implemented. And it has an interface for the Sony Venice focus hook, which can be replaced or can be detached from the camera body and attached on our top plate um, itself. This top plate, by the way, is as well compatible to our CCH4 for our, our handle at the top. And um, the design of the CCH4 recently changed. So we now have a slotted hole design, as you can see here. Um, it can be that still in the rental houses there are um, some of the old designs, but just that you know there is now a slotted design. And therefore, it's maybe not so important anymore to use the sliding adapter we have as a separate part. The other part which is compatible to the top plate is the mini viewfinder bracket, the MVB1, with the adapter to adapt the Sony Venice viewfinder to our viewfinder interface. And last but not least, now we have side brackets available. This was one of the requests we had from users. They said, please, we would like to have additional mounting options. We would like to have um, more protection um, for the camera. So we have mounting options. We have three eight inch interfaces, quarter inch interfaces, M4 interfaces. You can attach accessories such as an RMB3, an RMB8, or rosette adapters, RA6, in different positions. As I said, it's a protection for the camera body. It improves the overall stability. And again, we have the multi-hex screws implemented. We realized that a lot of camera crews, when using our accessories, they are combining them with accessories from another brand, from wooden camera. And this is the power distribution from wooden camera. And for us, it was quite important that our new side brackets are compatible with the wooden camera D-Box power strip. And as you can see here in the picture, they are compatible. We have new sets available, four different sets. Two are called broadcast sets and two are called cine sets. Both are available in a basic and a pro version. The broadcast sets, they have the broadcast shoulder adapter implemented, 
attaching to VCT14 style quick plates and the Cinesets, they have the bridge plate adapter BPA5 implemented. The difference between a basic and a pro set is that the basic set is missing the side brackets and missing the mini viewfinder bracket with the adapter for the Sony Venice viewfinder. If you want to have these products as well, go for the pro set. The first customer shipment of the Venice 2 is supposed to be in February 22. And it seems it will be more mid to end of February. So it will match exactly our first customer shipment, which will be in calendar week 822. So thank you very much for watching and stay tuned for more information from Ari.